So here is Jawan Washington for the first time on Scott and BR on the Mighty 1090. Jawan, good afternoon. Oh, how you doing? Doing great, man. Yourself? Oh, I'm doing good. Just got out of practice. Yeah, how's the first couple days treating you? Oh, it's been good, you know, been getting out there, getting at it, you know, going against the defense every day, keeping the energy on us, just getting better every day. Now, are there two-a-day practices, or are these now just one-a-day practices? How's this work? Uh, for this camp, we're just doing one-a-day practices. We have some walkthroughs early in the morning, but as of right now, we're just uh, one day with it. Is camp an all-day thing still? Yes, it's all day. We, You know, we come uh, early in the morning, we have breakfast and meetings all day, and uh, sometimes we have a lift every once in a while, and then we just practice later on in the day. So your day isn't like, hey, meetings, break, lift, eat, come back, practice, get done, review. I mean, is it – I mean, it's got to be very structured, right? Oh, yeah, it is. I'm, Almost just like you just said right there. Yeah, because that lifting part of it's important, man. You can't just lift during the summer and then go to training camp, dude. you got to keep that on. Oh, no, yeah. Coach Hall, he does a really good job of keeping us lifting while we're – are in the season and we're going along with it so we can stay strong and be able to go out there every day. All right, Jawan Washington is considered to be the starting running back for the San Diego State football team. It's early in training camp, but Donnell Pumphrey, 2,000-plus, Rashad Penny, 2,000-plus. Jawan, is that like your number one individual goal to keep this streak of 2,000-plus yard rushers going? Is that a big deal for you? Uh, the main thing is just to go out there and just work hard every day. And I, I feel like if I just do that, that'll come along with it. But as of right now, we just have a team goal to go out there and win a championship. So I'm not really looking towards a 2,000-yard season right now. I'm just going out there to try to be as best I can every day. Do you think Christian Chapman wants you to have a 2,000-yard season? Uh, if, if that helps the team win, I'm sure he does. <laughs> uh, everybody on the team wants to be able to win games. So anything that comes along with that is – more than I mean, I, for the team. We, we've been talking to this kid since he was a freshman. He was on last week, and he said, look, I'm telling you, we're going to open the playbook a little bit more this year. I'm going to I'm going to throw for more yards this year. We're going to throw oh, the yeah. ball. And I'm thinking to myself, well, if you got another 2,000-yard rusher, that means the, the running back will probably have more yards rushing than the quarterback will have passing. <laughs> oh, yeah. That's, that's something we, just, we pride on is that uh, running the ball. We want to stop a strong, but – I feel like this year we're going to be able to make a lot more plays over the top, and uh, Christian will do a good job of finding guys down the field, and we got a lot of guys that can go make plays. So I think it'll be more evened out this year, and it'll be really good for the offense. All right, we're talking to Jawan Washington, the running back for the San Diego State football team. You look at these guys, Pumphrey, 2,133 yards in 2016. Rashad Penny, 2,248 yards in 2017. Uh, this is a young man who's going to be able to take over that, that role as the starting running back, as the featured back, will he be able to do the same thing? Juwan, you're from Texas, is that right? Yes, sir. What part of Texas are you from? I'm from Fort Worth, Texas. So, kid from Fort Worth, Texas, how does he get to San Diego State? Uh, it was just all about the, the vibes that I had uh, coming up here on my visit, and uh, Coach Horton, uh, my running back coach, He's the officer coordinator, and he's also from the same part of Texas I'm from. So it was just a connection with our, once I got there. Coach Jordan's nephew actually went to my high school, and we were really good friends growing up. So that, that played a big part in it also. And uh, just when I came out here on my visit, just, I just felt, really felt connected with the guys that were already here. And um, it was really good, and it felt really family-oriented when I was here, and it just helped with my decision. Where else you consider? Uh, I, just, I had a few small schools here and there in Texas that I was looking at, but at the end of the day, I just want to get uh, get outside of that and just have fun with it. So, dude, you you're saying that that you had a, I mean, you played big time high school football. You must have if you were playing in the state of Texas and you're in the the Fort Worth Dallas area. Mm -hmm. were, were you under recruited because people looked at your size and like, oh, this kid's five foot seven. You know, he's a little short, but he's thick. He's strong. I mean, do you think that you were prejudged because of your height? Oh yeah, definitely that a uh, few few times, but you know, I just Coach Ryan, he really gave me a a chance to show what I can do, and then came up there and he just gave me the most opportunities. I just make the best of it. But all these running backs, Pumphrey, Penny, and now yourself, very different kinds of running backs. I mean, you look back at Donnell, he's kind of short, and frankly, he's really kind of skinny. And then you look uh -huh. at Rashad, and he's a lot taller and a lot thicker. I mean, he's a bull. I mean, that guy can run people over. 
Then you got mm-hmm. a guy like you who's listed at 5'7", 190. That's like Darren Sproles kind of physique and, and stats, and that's sort of your game too, right? I mean, you're a speed player. Oh, yeah. Yeah, I, I just one of the things I've been watching film and uh, just from both of those guys, and, and there's one thing I was doing in this offseason, I just wanted to kind of take 50% of DJ and uh, 50% of Rashad, and I feel like if I take – take that much from each one of them that'll be a, a, a good hundred percent Juwan Washington and I think that that's the thing that uh that helped me most this year and I had those two guys in front of me those two years to be able to watch and learn and uh so when it's my chance to step up I'll be able to be ready for that opportunity. Yeah you had you had Rashad Penny last year, Donnell Pumphrey the year before you had a chance to watch those guys but still productive 17 touchdowns over the last 20 games coming into this season. So, dude, are you going to still return kicks and possibly even punts? Yes, right now it's planned for me to uh, be able to return kicks in the return game and to just help out, get uh, get them more touches, you know, be able to help the team out a little bit. All right. Jawan Washington making his first appearance on Scott BR fresh off the practice field at San Diego State. Dude, thank you very much for the time. Stay healthy, and we look forward to having a great season. Uh, thank you for having me. Right on, Jawan Washington.